race as former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin and gets in a few jabs while campaigning for Karen Handel. Channel 2's Lori Geary now live in Midtown Atlanta after asking Palin if a college degree matters. And Sarah Palin gave a very colorful response to that question. She comes at a critical time for Karen Handel, who according to the polls is behind in the Republican field. But she is responding to her critics who are questioning her lack of a college degree. Really, it's always a pleasure to be back in the, the peach state and with all you beautiful southern belles. A visit from the former governor of Alaska, Sarah Palin, came at a crucial time for Republican U.S. Senate candidate Karen Handel. This video from a January Republican event in Bibb County shows one of Handel's GOP opponents, David Perdue, indirectly criticizing her for not having a college degree. Okay. I'm sorry, these issues are so much broader, so complex. Some in this race think the problems in Washington are a little too complex for a gal like me. In typical handle fashion from four years ago when she lost a close primary fight to Governor Nathan Deal, she fought back, reminding folks she left an abusive home at the age of 17. But I'm here to tell you that fixing the problems in Washington, D.C., it's not rocket science. It's going to take guts and resolve in an individual with a real determination. Handel and Palin played to mostly a crowd of female supporters at the Green Manor in Union City. Handel hoping to gain some traction against Purdue, who's now leading in an exclusive Channel 2 Action News poll, did not let up. And now we even have the so-called outsider who looks down on those who have not had the opportunity to live a life of privilege. You, Neither did Palin. Should a college degree matter? Uh, I think there are a lot of, uh, a lot of good, hardworking Americans who have more common sense in their little pinky finger than a lot of those Ivy League pieces of paper up on a wall uh, that uh, represent some elitism versus common sense. I asked David uh, Purdue's camp for a response. They released a statement to me saying, quote, uh, Purdue grew up the son of two public school teachers and worked his way through Georgia Tech by taking construction and warehouse house jobs. You can read much more on David Purdue's statement on WSBTV.com. Reporting live from Midtown Atlanta, Lori Geary, Channel 2 Action News. Michelle Nunn's considered the Democratic